viewers you guys see page youtube channel please subscribe channel for more videos and to get the redeem support for 10 days today we are discussing about 3 years experience candidate real time interview questions and answers recently one of my friend he was attended interview one of the interview okay in that interview the interviewer asked some questions same questions he note down and he given to me same i am showing to you okay So after introduction, uh, work experience, everything, the interviewer, he was asked to my friend. The first question was, what is your role in implementation project? What are all activities you done in that project? He, this is the first question. My friend was told, I am the lead consultant in the project for SD module. Okay. Along with, okay. Along with my senior, I went for requirement gathering. We collected the we collected the business scenarios, okay. Business scenarios, how they are doing business in their uh, in their current software step by step. Along with their uh, questionnaire, they prepared as is document. After that, uh, they converted as is to to be document, okay. So once uh, BPP document completed, they taken sign off and uh, they started development. Okay, after configuration done, okay, they done the integration configuration, uh, integration, uh, what uh, total configuration and a uh, uh, unit con uh, yeah, baseline configuration, uh, integration configuration. Okay, both uh, they done in uh, DAO 110. After that, they tested in 120. Okay, after uh, it's everything is fine, then they move to quality system. After that, they move to production. Okay, these are all activities. He was performed in that implementation project. Okay. The next question. In which area are you strong? My friend was told. There is no particular concept. I can able to handle maximum all the concept. Whichever I mentioned in my resume. Like OTC process. STO, third party IPO, conjunct and intercompany sales, intercompany STO. And the basic, basic functions is there, right? Uh, pricing, credit, so whatever, ever, everything explained, we told. Okay. After that, the interview asked, have you worked on credit management as for Anna? He told yes. Then can you please explain me the configuration of it and the process of it working as for Anna? Okay. My friend was told step by step the configuration. Okay. Uh, the first step FI, they, they need to create current control area. SD point of view, this is the path, including path he told, like that he prepared, okay? SD said we have to create the segments and that we have to assign to create, uh, create control area. The sales area also have to assign create segment and uh, checking groups, we have to assign sales document types and delivery and PGI. In pricing process, subtotal, we, we have to maintain a, the combination of create control area, risk category, risk category group, we have some controls, okay? And uh, in that we have some controls if their item check, reaction, status block, everything he explained. Okay. Process when our customer credit exceeded, system will block the order level and delivery level and PG level based on the risk category. Okay. In BP, we have select the role is uh, in a separate role is for credit management, UKM 000. Okay. And uh, we have to go to create profile. There we have to select the risk category and create roles. Okay, in BP how it will work, everything he explained. Okay. Next, what is the what is the T code for release in the credit block VKM4? Do you have any idea of T codes in a credit management asporana? Okay, he aware and some T codes. He told the one is that this is the credit exposure T code. This is the T code to delete the credit limit liabilities. This is the T code to uh, update the oldest open item values okay so from s4 ana he got the three questions okay from credit management next do you have any idea how tax gl will assign and what is the integration between sd and fi maybe the question is given wrong so maybe the question was any idea about tax gl okay tax gl and assignment who is taking care of that uh, sdr fi and uh, what is the integration between sd and fi 
the fi will take care to assign the tax gl okay in our tax classification class we, ex we clearly explained about this questions if you see in that class you can able to answer this question okay here if if you observe whatever whatever he answered here everything we covered i explained in my previous class uh, interview question 71 72 everything i explained okay almost 99% same questions repeated okay 99% same questions repeated same questions he answered okay the fit will create the tax condition type that uh, they will place in the tax process that that will they are assigning to country code Yeah, fair team will they create the tax code, against the tax codes, uh, they are assigning tax GL. Yes, the point of view, the tax condition types we need to place, uh, we need to create the tax condition that we need to place in the pricing procedure. We need to maintain condition records. Okay, and uh, that concludes. We are going to maintain that uh, the HSN code that they are assigning combination of that they are creating uh, tax condition, tax condition records we are maintaining. So you can follow that class. What are we explain? Same as this, you can tell. are you done third party and ipo sales ipo process yes okay he explained about first uh, third party process and the configuration okay the configuration and item category we have the billing rules f g what the different what is the what is the purpose of f g and everything he explained okay and uh, in settle and category we have three fields order type and b item category five it is account assignment e one everything you explain and billing uh, copy control we have the billing quantity okay in ipo process e business process here ipo process i suggested him first explain me about first explain to him about business process later how it will work in sap later configuration step this process you can follow to impress the interviewer okay next ipo process okay next have you opened an idox What the T code to reprocess the IDAG? Okay, you told yes. I work on IDAG. The T code is BD eighty seven to reprocess the existing IDAG. W ninety one is also using the reprocess the IDAG in case of there is a changes in the IDAG. We are going to do changes and we reprocess the IDAG. So uh, when I am doing the reprocess, system generate the new IDAG. Okay, this IDAG class also we explain. I think sixty nine class. Okay, you can see that class to answer the, the uh, IDAG questions. Okay. do you have any idea about ida configuration he explained step by step this uh, this is the first ticker to create the logical system as an logical system to maintain rfc connection to maintain port information distribution model as into message types okay partner profile generation so everything he explained okay and uh, in case if they want new segments or new basic ones or new message types it's so, okay this everything we covered in that class you can go through that class and what is the table for pricing in esporana in esporana prcd underscore elements i want to know particular condition type value in sale order how can i get that nothing but what is the logic for condition type okay that base price condition type what is the logic okay he was told we have to pass the sale order number in vbap table okay here we will take the document condition number but uh, it has to be vbak not vbap okay vbak table you has to pass the sale order number to get the document condition number those document condition number we need to pass in prcd underscore elements here you will get the condition type okay condition type value condition type value so we are taking the condition type value we have to tell it is equal to pr00 if you are asking basic type because we have to take the condition type value we have to take condition type value when if it is equal to this clarity we need to explain maybe is not explained this clarity we need to explain if if it is if it is equal to pr00 if it is asking base price pr discount discount condition like that we need to tell okay have you opened any arrangement yes my client is having 32 company codes and the business want to number range combination sales org plant division and billing type wise okay this is the requirement so same requirement we told in our previous uh, classes that uh, in number range announcement same he explained okay same he was explained okay the program user exit this table we created against this table we are maintaining the number range okay so whenever uh, uh, whenever 
invoice is generating going system is going to check the table if the table level number range is maintained it is taking the number range it will achieve it giving the number okay same was explained how we uh, done that how we explained in that class okay yeah have you any uh, do you have any idea on in, uh, intercompany sales nothing but intercompany billing okay he explained about the process okay if you are asking configuration we have to tell the configuration here just he asked the intercompany sales you are aware he just explained here don't need to explain configuration because of the interviewer not asked he asked only what is the uh, process of intercompany sales just we have to tell that's it whatever you asking that is the only we have to tell don't need to tell more than that okay how we uh, va01 copy the price usually va0 we are not making condition records but how price is getting for va0 condition because of we we are maintaining va0 condition type in pa p1 pa01 so we are making condition of pa01 so whatever price is maintained pa the same price it copying okay this we need to explain clearly okay have you obtained any g reports yes okay can you tell me how you provide a logic to provided logic to evapor so what are you given same i written here logic to evapor so one one report we explain g report we explain in my our previous class okay our g reports class same same he was explained okay same he was explained okay same he was explained so finally after this all questions the interview was very impressed and he my friend got the job in that company okay friends go simple please go through all the videos i explained very detail very simple way okay you can easily grab the information okay the interview also interview questions also i given the format how we have to answer what kind of question the interview might can ask okay the clearly i explain okay this is a better way to get the job to follow the concepts okay the next class i am going to cover partner determination we have a partner determination customer master but partner determination also is there in sale order level delivery level and billing document level that i am going to explain in the next class okay please subscribe to the channel for more videos and share it to your friends and your sap groups to get the more subscription thank you all for your love and support